Yes, yeah. I'm really excited yeah. about speaker. Yeah, okay, thanks. Yeah. Hi, I'm Larry LaRocco, Democratic candidate for the United States Senate. There's a lot of energy in Idaho these days. People are moving here for a quality of life and a great place to raise their families. Idaho needs dynamic leadership in Washington, D.C. that's equal to the people that are crying out for that leadership every day. I'll provide that leadership and we'll have real change for a change in Washington. Now I'd like to introduce to you my wife of 40 years, Christine Biddy Ganetta Larocco. Uh, dedicated to the people. I think that would be a good one. I, I really believe that that's the reason Larry works at these jobs uh, one day in every town so that he can get close to the people and that takes dedication. He wants to know what they're talking about, he wants to hear what they need, he wants to know what's missing in their lives and, and what's taking away their hope. Charlie, our grandson, is a three-year-old who has Larry's same sense of humor. It's hilarious to be with them together because they are, he turned, both of them turn into little kids running around. Um, but Charlie represents the future to Larry, and just like every grandparent, we don't want this future to be a murky future where they're not going to have a good job, they're not going to be able to get a great education, they won't have health care. We, we worry about that. But I believe the issue that he would feel would affect the most people is uh, health care. Health care. He's, he's livid that there's not uh, adequate health care for people around this country. And uh, as he works in these jobs around the state, he, he finds that people don't have health care. He meets people who are on their, um, they've ha already declared medical bankruptcy, yet they work in a nursing home. They are health care givers, yet they have no health care. It's like Larry's quest is to bring bipartisanship into the state of Idaho. If he has to go and do it himself, he will run for office to do that. It's so important to him to live in a, a, in a state where there's fairness, where both sides are heard. That's very important to Larry. He has tremendous amount of energy. He's been there, and to me, that means he knows what to do when he gets back there. Many of his colleagues have gone out for a while and then run again, either for governor or for uh, Senate, because they get back into the, the, uh, the state and live among the people again, they say, oh my goodness, there is so much more to fix. I'm not finished. Larry's not finished. 